Freaking awesome! <laughs> 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 <And> to <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Hedgehog Sci-Fi Gaming. <laughs> I'm Joker. You guys see me in some other videos. This is my friend Cody. He came to uh, do not quite an unboxing of the Indominus box. What we're doing is a gamer's perspective style unboxing. Everybody's done an unboxing, including GW. So, because we're gamers and not collectors and all this stuff, we decided we're going to go through it and show you what we think and what we like and what we dislike. Mm -hmm. So, Cody? Uh -huh. uh I don't know what you want me to do. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very... <laughs> Cody? Yep. Right. Cody's box. Ah, yes. My box. <laughs> so, go ahead and crank the sucker open, and we'll just kind of go through it. New box syndrome. Art. Packing material. <laughs> <laughs> so, we got our lieutenant and... Yep. Okay, so your thoughts on the lieutenant? Thoughts on the lieutenant. Like the vote. Volkite Blaster, yep. and it looks like his shield is going to be easier to replace. Oh yeah, because it just folds yeah. onto his hand. You'll have to restructure. You'll have to restructure the hand a little bit. If you look, it's got a knot. Oh, right you know, you take it off, whatever. Yeah. So on mine, I hate the head. Head's gone. I replaced it with a Dark Angel's head. I've got a. Uh, I've got. Yeah. The Forge World. Oh. Heads. So, so it's 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 not Dark Angels. It's just the more knight style heads. So. I'm going for Space Wolves. The head doesn't bother me so much, but all these halos. Yeah, that's going to go. First thing, getting off completely. Yep. Okay, and the nasty undead Necron. He's, I don't he's, he, he's going to get panned up and set to the side in case someone wants, <laughs> wants to play him for the first time. All right. Eventually. Eventually, yeah. They Necrons. Captain. Um, He's a captain. Yeah. <clears throat> so, captain, the uh, the new rules on the storm shields give him a four up invul instead of a three up, and one extra to his save. So he becomes a two up save captain with a four up invul. Which a lot of people are complaining about that, but with the new wound allocation rules, yeah, it, 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 it's the better. Yep. So I hate the Necron so much I didn't even put that one on the base. Yeah. <laughs> so and uh, I replaced on mine. I replaced the tilting shield with a dark angel shield, and the head with a knight head. Even though th this one comes with three different heads, and one of them actually looks like a knight with his visor up, whatever. Yeah. You have the heads, man. Yeah. Keep it consistent. And then Necron Overlord of some sort. He's an undead robot. <laughs> Deadly. <laughs> we're we're marine players. Yeah. <laughs> if you haven't guessed, uh, bikes. Love them. Uh, space. Yeah. If, uh, I can, if they can get counted as wolf guard, they'd be interesting, but I doubt they will, so... Uh, they'll probably get a keyword. Yeah. They're going to roll them all in. Yeah. According to GW, all of the Marines, except for Grey Knights, are going to get supplements to a new codex. So instead of having the Dark Angels codex, the Space Wolves codex, Blood, Blood Angels codex, it's going to be codex, Adeptus Astartes, and then the supplements like they did for... Ultramarines, Raven Guard, Raven Guard, Iron White Scars, Hands. Iron Hands. So, yeah, but my concern is, so, the Wolf Guard bikers I originally had got put into Legends. Yeah. And I just have the blo um, Blood Claw bikers. Really hope these don't become Blood Claw bikers. Nah, they won't, because they're Primaris. Now mine, I've chopped up uh, Raven Wing Sprue, or Raven Wing Upgrade Sprue, and on the front axle. It's not. I'm a biker in real life, so the, the whole not steering thing, just whatever. Uh, so, yeah, on the front axle thing, I've got the Ravenwing fairings that I split for the two normal guys and for the or the sergeant of the group. It's actually a custodian's banner that Ooh. I cut the wings. The, the yeah. wings are separate. Yeah. I cut them off. I'll, uh, I'll see if we can get some pictures of those and put them in just so people can see them. So yeah, love it. Other than the fact that the cat or the sergeant's head is bare, and on his oh. on his body or his legs, the helmet's molded on. Really? Yeah. Oh. So. That's annoying. yeah, and it's if you look to try and cut that yeah, out. Yeah, I mean, no, it's so, possible. Yeah, so that's those guys are gonna have bare heads. The other guys are not. That's. 
Then who I'm most excited for, Assault Intercessors. Oh, yes. Because what is Space Wolf without Chainswords? And they get minus one AP now. Yep. Which is always exciting. So, going by the new rules, these guys are three attacks for yep. the sergeant, two attacks for the dweebs. Yep. Plus one for the chainsword, so that's four and three, so we're at seven, plus one for the charge, so that's twelve attacks on the charge, or if you're charged because of Angels of Death. Oh yeah, these guys, going back to that, mm -hmm. are stupid, because it's four and three attacks, if I remember correctly, we'll, we'll look it up, but when they charge, on the charge they get plus two attacks. So, they already plus one attack for the charge, plus two attacks for, or plus one attack for the chainsword, plus two attacks for the special rule, plus one attack for the charge, so we're at plus four to whatever they have. It's like 15, to, 15 attacks or something like that? Alright, I'm, I'm slightly happier about those, because <laughs> now I, won't, I can use the space wolf stratagem of exploding sixes. Yeah, there you go. And there we go. I believe I can use on them. Yep. Yeah, you should be able to. There's, they, they will have the Space Wolves keyword. Yeah, I can't remember its only characters, though, is the thing. Ah. I'll have to look that up. I'll look it up. Yeah. Oh, hang on just a second. So, I'm a GW fanboy, and I subscribe to their new app, and it's got all the rules. Oh. So. I am on iOS, so I do not have that. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, I would also be pulling it out. I do have the digital codex, though. Codex Space Wolves. It's I easy right here, because I can just go to, it's a stratagem. Yeah, I think it's uh, Prophecy of the Wolf. Though. Prophecy of the Wolf, so we'll just roll down oh, to... Oh, man, that's super convenient. Yep. Nope. Nope. No, because it goes overwhelming savagery to seeking a saga. So, we'll figure it out. Mm. But some of them have been changed in the FAQ. Yeah. Yeah, look, Necrons. Necrons! <laughs> hey. I, do, I do like the... There's no more stupid green rod. Oh, or and the head does not have a separate neck piece. All right, oh, I've got big fat thumbs and fingers trying to put that little. No, I will never build another neck round again. That's half the reason I'm just you know getting rid of those. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> also fat fingered, so mm, I'm looking forward to it. The the War of the Worlds model is kind of cool. The Walker thing. I can't wait to blow it up. Yes. <laughs> more. Warriors. Warriors and Scarabs. The Scarabs actually got a little scarier from everything I've heard. Just, you know, they're getting an upgrade. Ah, uh, uh, yes. Then the Blade Guard, the Chaplain, Banner, and... Judiciar. Melton. And the Melted Guy. Oh, yeah, Judiciar. Yeah. I forgot about him. Oh, he's sexy. I mean, uh... <laughs> <laughs> he will be interesting. Yeah. He's definitely getting a wolf skull skull helmet though. Oh yeah, and the I mean his stop time thing. Yeah. So basically, he can any enemy unit within six inches, you choose one, and they have to fight last, no matter what. Uh, so something I'm hoping they FAQ. It was mentioned. I think it was only on a community post, so they don't know what they're talking about. That the blade guard would get the wolf guard keyword. Yeah, they said the same thing for the death wing. Would, which would be very nice, because yep. Ajax Rockfist would love to run with these guys and give them extra attacks. Oh, yeah. Throw Belial down with the uh, Blade Guard vets. Oh, yeah, it'd be dumb. Yeah. But again, first things coming off are these stupid halos. <laughs> I'm even going to try to take the ones off there. Just keep a little consistency in there. Yeah. Well, worst comes to worst on that one, you just lop it off and put one of the skull heads on it. Yeah. Or the, the wolf skulls on it. Yeah. So very interested to see if the Gravis boys actually become Terminators or if they just keep getting heavy weapons. Yeah, that's a, that's a toss-up on those. I kind of do wish they would take as, as a Terminator equivalent, and I say that as a person that's got like 40 freaking Terminators in his Death Guard or Deathwing army. I would love to actually have... Okay, so I love my, my firstborns. Alright, I've got a boatload of them. Uh, but they're so fragile now with the new weapons. So they're one wound, and 90% of them don't have an invulnerable save. So you throw them out there, they get popped by a bolter or a auto gun from a cultist, and they die. Uh, every, all these guys that have the 
the better saves and more toughness and more wounds because of the Gravis armor would be awesome. Yes, it would be. Just interesting to see what they can do. Yeah. And be able to ride in some of the new vehicles would be convenient. Yeah. Still not quite sure why the Firstborn Marines can't ride in anti-grav, but... Because they don't have the right connections for the safety equipment. Mm, of course. Gothic OSHA says no. <laughs> <laughs> and we do have to always be OSHA approved. Yes. Or bribe OSHA. One of the two. Yeah, yeah. Just don't let them see what we do. So, <laughs> looked it up quick. Yep. The sixes for additional hits is the super stra super stratagem in the salt phase. Okay. Super doctrine, that's gotcha. yours. And the stratagem okay. is four plus for mm. character. Yeah. That'll so, work. Yeah. So, that'll be nice. So. Okay. So, your thoughts on the new Melta? New Melta. I wish they kind of come up with some better designs. I do kind of like the handle on the top. Yeah. But it looks like they just kind of took a plasma, a plasma incinerator, and put a melt barrel on the front of it. It does. Which kind of makes me sad. Mm. But, eh. I kind of wonder if they're going to come up with another flamer variant. I don't... I don't know that they would. Since they've got the uh, flamestorm gauntlets on yeah. the aggressors. Yeah, I think. Wait. I don't know. I do kind of like the chaplain look. Yeah. I, I like I like the book, and there's his whole stack about him. Yeah, I, I beheaded him and put a knight. Yeah. I, I One of the helmets I have looks like it's got a speaker built into it, mm. so I put that on it. That way it looks like he's still yelling, but not having a stupid bear head to get shot in. <laughs> yeah, that's something I, I understand. Yeah, I never did get the, hey, I'm in a giant walking suit of armor, I'm going to take my helmet off. Now, you know, because I guess we don't have communications. Like, the Space Wolves, <laughs> their whole thing is we didn't ever wear helmets that dulled our senses. Yeah. And I can understand that, like, lore-wise for the Blood Claws. I understand that. They're stupid. Noobs. But, <laughs> after that, you think, man, I saw quite a few of my buddies get shot in the head. Yeah. Because they have a bunch of backup organs. Not None a brain. of them. Yeah. None of them in the head. <laughs> so, yeah, I have not yet built the aggressors or whatever they are, the yeah. the Melta boys. Mm -hmm. uh, I have built the rest of the characters in the Blade Guard and the bikes. Uh, folks, when you're building the bikes, it's if, if you're not doing it press fit and you're actually gluing, there's a, a peg system. Cut the interior peg down short, or else they don't seat right. I have one that I had to use super glue and fill a gap, and it looks ugly, and it makes me mad, and I'm going to have to figure out some way to cover it. Oh, I'm also going to cut the uh, mufflers off and do custom exhausts on all of them, because of course. in the grim darkness of the far future, there is no excessive noise ordinance. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. I mean, it, I, I'm pretty sure they don't have a cat. Sorry, biker. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. the uh, I, I do like the new negative one on the uh, chain swords, the Astartes yeah. chain swords. Yes, I hope that gets brought across. Time yeah, um, the twin bolters. Let's go ahead and crack open your uh, yeah. silence, what is the the edge of silence book. Yeah, just so we've got the rules that we can actually talk about instead of trying to remember. Yeah, we've got the rules here. Why don't we look at them? This is a nice book. It's got good stuff in it. Again, GW fanboy, so I mean they can do wrong, but on this I think they did good. All right, so we go to the Outrider Squad. So they've got the Twin Bolt Rifle, Rapid Fire Two, and if I remember correctly, that goes because now they're not a vehicle, so they won't get the their vehicle. Now keywords. Oh really? Yeah, Outrider Squad biker. Oh yeah, that's so, right. They don't get the. Yeah, they'll get the extra point. extra rapid fire. Yep. But it's still a uh, 30 inch range rapid fire two. With their 14 inch movement. So you can pretty much get within half range about any. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there it is. If this unit makes a charge move, add two to the attack characteristics until the end of the turn. So Man. use that, and then use the strat to let them attack again. And. Hopefully whatever you're up against is dead, because, yeah, it's... Oh, sorry, two and three, instead of 
three or four like I thought it was. But yeah, for three of them, it's only six power level. Oh. They, don't, they you can't get any more than three in the in the group, which. I'm a Raven Guard or Raven Guard, Ravenwing player, so I'm used to having full squads with yeah. attack bikes. So only having three is kind of like, eh, but they put out enough work that I think it'll be alright. Well, I think even with the new blast rules, I think you're not going to want to go more than five. No. So you're not down two. Well, depending on the new rules, I always combat squad them out anyways. Yeah. But yeah, who knows with the new rules coming in? Yeah. So. Yeah. The. Uh, the, out, uh, the Assault Intercessor Squad. These guys, I'm just like, oh dude, you gotta be kidding me, right? Because you can do, you can combat squad them out of the 10. So, I got two boxes, so I've got 20 of the dudes. So I'm gonna have either two big squads or four little squads. This is gonna be great. Yep. My Dark Angels are just gonna be dumb and I feel kind of bad about it. No, I don't. Ah. Uh, Alright, I'm a little hurt by GW. Uh oh. There's no Space Wolf. Nope. Ultra. There sure isn't. Those traitors. Ultra Gar er, Ultramarines. Well, poster boys. Oh, yeah. yeah. White Scars. Oh, Raven, er, Raven Guard. Fists. Deathwing. Salamanders. Blood Angels. Salamanders are actually getting a bonus with these. Because of the. Uh, the way that their strats yeah, work. Yeah. The, oh, it's dumb. The melta strat. So yeah, it's. Well. Yeah, I got. Like I gotta go charge in factory or something about this nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. The eradicator squad. That's, that's what those it. guys are. Yep. Yeah, I didn't. Truthfully, I hadn't even looked at them because I got all excited about the bikes. No. Nope. Bolt pistol and melta rifle. Twenty-four inch range, so it's basically a uh, multi melta. Yep. Except it's assault, not heavy. Which is convenient. Run them forward, pop yep. them. Yeah. If you're playing armor against these guys and you see those guys on the table, just don't go anywhere near them. And blast them off from range if you can. Yeah, because they only got 5 inch move, which yeah. makes sense. Yeah, 5 inch, tough 5 because of the Gravis armor. Yeah. So, or the, yeah. And you could make vague comments about the Necrons, but I... Neither of us play them. I think I played them once, against them once in 8th edition. Yeah. So... Yeah, I, the Plasmancer. He is... He looks like a Fabius Bile mm -hmm. model. He's got stuff sticking off the back of him. So... Yeah. Sorry, folks, but... Marine players. Marine players. Guard players. Yeah. Yep. That, so... Huh? Any more thoughts, brother? No, I'm just very excited to see what this edition does. Heck yeah. All right. We'll make sure to bring some, uh, at least, battle summaries, if not a full battle report, uh, to the either DZ Sabres channel or the Hedgehog Historicals Facebook page. Go ahead and look us up, Hedgehog Historicals Gaming. For, uh, you can hit us up there with any questions. HedgehogHistoricalsGaming at gmail.com is our email address. For any questions, comments, concerns, let us know. I'm Joker. This is Cody. See you later.